Hello and welcome to Pure Word Creations. My name is Tahira. I have a custom journal flip through for you today. A good friend of mine ordered a journal for her friends and their uh, months old uh, infant girl. And this is the first time I've done any kind of like family album style journal. So this was really cool for me to, to create. Um, the front here has an acetate pocket with a journaling card. And as you see, there are empty photo corners there because I've taken out all of the family photos, um, whether that's loose photos, um, photos in photo corners or photos that I've put in my um, collage journaling cards. I've taken those out for the movement for the video. And in the background here, you see a, um, a digital by Tanya Samuels. And on the back, I believe that's Tim Holtz paper. And then this is also a digital frame. And I'll leave that in the description box. So this lace here and this brown lace is from Renee at GT Designs and Vintage Art Supplies. The spine um, is a layered board and um, I painted it with acrylic paint, paint, gold paint, to match the rest of the cover. And then I found this fabric, excuse me, <laughs> I found this fabric at a secondhand store and um, I was told that the parents come from Mexican, Creole, Lebanese, and German cultures. And I know that um, in Mexican and Lebanese cultures, they have a basket weaving uh, tradition. So I wanted to honor that. And it was so cool that this fabric had um, this basket here and this uh, pottery here. Um, and there are metal corners that I was gifted. All right, so going inside, there is a digital from Nick the Booksmith, paper by uh, Stamperia. Music paper. Here are some photo sleeves from a photo album I just took apart. Stationery from Aiko Fukawa. They're really cute and the paper feels amazing. This is eco dyed paper from Rosemary Morris. This is from a notepad. They like noodles, <laughs> I was told. So that's really cute stationery I got from Sticky Club. But I'll also put the artist um, in the description box because that's in small letters there. They like tacos. Found this um, in the Gather Journal. This is graph paper. Um, there you'll see some references of skulls. Um, the the dad is um, a vintage clothing, uh, has a vintage clothing business and um, a skull is a part of his logo. And the mother is a graphic designer and I believe she was instrumental in creating the logo. So you'll see some skulls. Here's some rub on flowers here. More eco dye paper from Rosemary Morris. Vintage Ledger that I got from Renee. Some You Are Beautiful stickers and some tags from uh, Lin Chia Ning.
here are book pages. Um, I found this, th this book on, it was like a dog sticker book and they had various scenes where you could put the dog stickers, <laughs> but the scenes are so lovely. Um, and, and work so well. Look at this. <laughs> it's like a playground. Um, and perfect for, um, you know, kind of a family book. So you'll see a couple of those in here. Here's some paper bits. This beautiful Rolodex card. Here is a coloring page of Sade by Madame Adrienne Muse. And here's a stencil. Thank you, Rosemary Morris, for letting us know about the stencil that's on Amazon. Really, really pretty. a die cut and an empty envelope, coin envelope. Guess check. Here's a page from um, A Beauty Collected and I'll put that information in the description box. So uh, turquoise. Here's a postcard, like a little ad postcard from um, vintage clothing and um, antique shops in Chicago. Um, I found this little book at an, also at the secondhand store that's basically writing letters to your child so that they can open it later in life. Kind of look like that. And fold up to be an envelope. So there are a few of those in the journal. Made this pocket out of fabric um, that I was given by Renee. And I just topped it with some lace. Here's a Sonia Choquette card. And just a blank card stock. Their um, favorite colors are mustard yellow, sage green, and coral. So you will see that reflected in the journal colors as well. Uh, they live in the Bay Area. Is a photo of a sunset in San Francisco. Um, the mother is into typography and hand lettering. So here's another um, digital from Tanya Samuels typography collection. I found this um, The Spanish kind of workbook, children's workbook at Salvation Army. Here's another one of those letter to your future child. They spent some time, or someone was, uh, one of the parents <laughs> um, came fr uh, is from Chicago area. Ledger. 
Um, this is the author Rackham postcard. His uh, illustrations find themselves in a lot of children's books. There's another page from a beauty collected. It says a wing there. And the willow. And this is just an empty pocket. I found this amazing baby book um, in my local antique shop and it was from 1925 y'all and so I could put a couple of the, the empty pages um, here in the journal and it was in such good condition of course it has some aging but it's really really beautiful and um, at some point I'm sure I'll scan the photos of the you know filled in pages to use in future journals but for now I just you know took out the the empty pages to put in here here's some washi tape alphabet tape oh um this is hiding this ledger is hiding a tuck spot that I made from um, some of the family photos so um, I you know just covered that up and inside the tuck is this cursive writing page this is also empty line paper lovely fabric again from Renee and here is an art postcard from Michaela Henry Lowe I believe the lace is also from Renee as well as this coffee dyed paper and ledger. <laughs> this paper po um, pocket is um, made out of paper from Stamperia, as well as this. Um, here is a page from a Sears Roebuck & Co. ad book, I believe really really pretty that's from Renee as well here's another one of those Spanish workbooks pages I put a photo sleeve in each um, signature more Rosemary Morris eco dyed paper here's some I believe bond paper, I think that's what you call it, um, from sea salted paper. Here's some classic key stationery, and a doily. Here's a digital, I believe that's from Renee as well. And then um, here is a rub on from Dollar Tree. And then this came out of a book. Um, it was basically Make Your Own Museum. Not sure, it's on the back. Okay. This is a vellum piece. Here's another one of those pages from the dog sticker book. <laughs> Look at this, right? <laughs> Here's some more bits. Tim Holtz cards. And here's some uh, 
stationery from Daiso. Here is a beautiful digital page from Tucaso de Papel, Yvette. She's so talented. And I just put some washi tape down the middle, some empty washi tape. Here's an acetate pocket. It says, you will be my sunshine. And there's another one of these beautiful stationaries from Aiko Fukawa. Here's some washi paper that was just cut like that. <laughs> I just left it. And a postcard from Daiso. There's a game card. Another coloring book page from Madame Adrian Muse. As I said, one of the parents has German lineage. So this is from um, a digital from Nevermore Creations. I just made this uh, journaling card. Here are flash cards from A Tattered Dream. French on the back. It's empty. Here is a bag, a little baggie of a hot air balloon, and this card from Daiso inside. Here is a blank tag that I stamped a skull on and then put some Avril yarn. At the top, tea stain paper. Another one of those amazing pages from the dog sticker book. <laughs> um, here is a coloring book page um, from a coloring book called Welcome Home that I got at Dollar Tree. They are tea lovers. I'll put that in later. Here's some children's manuscript paper, writing paper. As I said, um, the mother is um, into hand lettering. So this is from a hand lettering book that I'll put in the description box. Here is another of um, Yvette's digitals from Tu Casa de Papel. Another um, stenciling. This is also from the Gather Journal. This is a um, herbal talisman ally card. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong, but that's from Velvet Back, and I'll put it correctly in the description box. Some other paper bits there from Stat, um, Smash book. Here's another one of those 1925 baby album pages. Oh, it's, I think it's a, a poem from Byron. And this says, Baby's First Valentine.
these are journaling tags, digitals from Tanya Samuels as well. Beautiful stamped, um, gel, I think this is a jelly plate um, from Magdalena at Fat Pickle Studio. Here's another one of those old German garbs digitals from Nevermore Creations. popcorn bag from Renee and inside here um, are cards game cards um, I believe the game is called pass the popcorn and it just has movie you know from movies I guess you're supposed to these are the clues And they like um, 80s and 90s fashion, so I try to find films from the 80s and 90s. Beautiful botanical page from the Edwardian. Botanical diary? <laughs> I'll, re I'll put it in the description box. Here's, um, I made the pocket on the top of the popcorn bag for this one, this side. And here's some Midori graph paper. Here's some more lovely fabric that I made into a pocket. That's from Renee as well. And I just put it um, some dark yellow paper from Dollar Tree. Found this Khalil Gibran quote. He's Lebanese American or was Lebanese American. The appearance of things changes according to the emotions, and thus we see magic and beauty in them while the magic and beauty are really in ourselves. It's a beautiful bag. Has another one of those write to your future child envelopes that's the other side of that to Casa de Papel digital it's a sugar skull embroidery image on there Really, really nice. This paper was also gifted to me. Another example of typography. Um, I have a paper photo corner punch, so I punched out some photo corners that they could use and put some double-sided tape on the back and just put those in a glassine bag. Here is a vintage french fry bag, also from Renee, so cute, and I just put um, some quotes from a tearaway calendar in there. Here's a library pocket with a library card. And I was at a bookstore some years ago and they had these little bookmarks by the cash register. This is from Hafiz. I love Hafiz. I used to read Hafiz a lot back in the day. <laughs> and this one says, and love says, I will, I will take care of you. 
to everything that is near. And that's from the gift. And there's a library card in there. Blank. And I've just left this pocket blank. Uh, sorry, empty. <laughs> and as you can see, I um, these photo corners were originally white, and I just distressed them with distressed ink. And then they also get a sticker pack that I will not open. <laughs> I forgot to mention this is like a blue jean for the inner spine fabric. And that is that all these little bits of paper keep <laughs> tagging along. Thank you so much.